Well, a typical day in the I&E department includes electrical, instrumentation, and sometimes helping the mechanicals and um, whoever needs help to keep out the plan working and running. First thing would be equipment, keep out the equipment and process and service, everything making functional for a daily basis. That's where they work most of the time, 24 hours, 365 days uh, of the year. And like I said, just keeping running. If something goes bad, we change it, put a new equipment, update it if it is if it's necessary. I like working and sometimes the day goes too fast. Sometimes it's a challenge because we want to get it done. Working on something, I wanted to start to the end, make it work. If I don't see it working, sometimes I feel like I fail at some point, but it's just to make it see the production coming up, you know. If you open an equipment, please go back and close it. That's the main thing. If I work on something, especially electricity, make sure that it's log out, tag out, or close for safety for others. I have a background in instrumentation and electrical, and there's two different fields at some point, but in the end, everything merged together. Same thing with mechanical, same thing with, a, uh, I would say, a welder. Everything combines in the end. Everything comes together and makes uh, the facility and service running and uh, keep everything functional. Uh, I was, I was uh, wondering in the beginning when I was hired for the city, saying what an electrician has to do in the water department. This is the thing. A lot of the equipment in here, it is electrical. It has to have an electrician or somebody with experience. Also, there's a lot of instrumentation, uh, controls, sensors, and different type of sensors, level sensors, uh, water meters, all combined. It makes one strong arm. For experience right now, Village Creek area, we had a really good team. Uh, we all combine, get together in mornings and see how many people it's gonna take to get the job ready. If it takes more than one person, we all jump in and try to get it done. Uh, for example, let's say we had to pull wire. All right, Luis, uh, you wanna pull a little bit? It would be hard to, for one person to pull the wire, push it in and pull it out, it would be easier as a team player and a team member to have a lead person as well, but uh, all, everybody pull and push at the same time. This is a great career. Uh, I study for mechanic, for a gas car mechanic. I never thought I want to be an electrician. I like to see when the light comes on. And that's one of the things that give me a motivation to increase, to improve, and to learn every day, every day something new. <laughs> uh, I have not, I have seen a co-workers just get a little shock. I got a person that he jumped, literally jumped almost four feet, somehow touch a wire with the metal part. You just see all the sparks and I look over, the next thing I see, he was like, four feet away. How he did it, don't know, but just be careful. <laughs>